Nissan of today is not super famous for participating in racing competitions, let alone winning them. But we assure you, just like any other Japanese automaker, they know their way around high-performance automobiles. Beyond 2024, the Nismo team is expected to release multiple new models that will boost Datsun's street cred within the sports car community. As always, the viewers of Automotive Territory Daily News will be the first to learn about this quintet of blade sharp racers. Subscribe to our channel, ring the notification bell not to miss the upcoming releases, and let's start the engines. Nissan Z Nismo We all knew that sooner or later, the next generation Z would be sharpened with the Nismo treatment. This time designers doubled down on the resemblance with the Fairlady 240ZG and implemented aerodynamic solutions that were explored on the Nissan Z GT500 race car. The so-called G-Nose now has a mesh grille for improved cooling. There are additional vortex generators at the front, side sills were reshaped, and extra downforce is generated by a tiny front and a three-piece spoiler in the rear. The newcomer rides on mismatched high-gloss aluminum 19-inch wheels wrapped in special Dunlop tires. These rims hide heavy-duty 4-piston caliper 15-inch brake rotors in the front and 13.8-inch rotors in the rear. Expectedly, the Nismo moniker brings along actual performance improvements. The twin-turbo 3.0-liter V6 will be enhanced with the GTR-derived solutions. This means that a redesigned wastegate, better cooling and ignition timing were converted to 20 extra horsepower and 34 pound-feet of torque. The most powerful Z now makes 420 HP and 384 pound-feet between 2000 and 5200 RPM. Sadly, the mill is controlled only via a 9-speed automatic. On the bright side, it features a Nismo-only clutch with two times faster downshifts, more aggressive launch control and a limit slip differential. Moreover, those who still want to get more control of the car will get to select multiple driving modes and can play around with pedal shifters and a manual handbrake. The 2024 Nissan C Nismo gets five exterior colors, but red is still the major tint for the Nismo Alcantara pointed dashboard, infotainment screens, and leather for suede Recaro seats. Nissan GTR Nismo Special Edition You can definitely say that a car model holds the status of an icon if it has been unchanged for the past 15 production years without a decline in sales. In 2024, you also should not expect any radical changes to the Godzilla, but the R35 generation of the GTR will achieve even more impressive performance heights. The upcoming facelift introduces a more aerodynamic grille, revised spoilers, and some adjustments to the available trims. At the heart of this affordable supercar is the well-known 3.8-liter V6 twin turbocharged engine, which has been fine-tuned to reduce noise and vibrations. The standard GTR now boasts 570 horsepower and 470 pound-feet of torque, while the Nismo variant pushes these numbers to 600 horsepower and 480 pound-feet. Nissan expanded the configurator with two new trims, the Premium Edition T-Spec, offering a specially tuned suspension and carbon disc brakes, and the Nismo Special Edition, which claims the title of the highest performing GTR. This model features high-precision, weight-balanced engine components, a front mechanical limited slip differential, and a clear-coated Nismo exclusive carbon engine hood. Inside the cabin, there is a blend of sporty red and black semi-aniline and Napa leathers. Unfortunately, though, in terms of technology, the new GTR falls short with an analog dashboard and a low-resolution 8-inch touchscreen that only supports Apple CarPlay. Nissan Skyline Nismo This is yet another exclusive release from Nismo that will be limited to just 1,000 units. All of them will be powered by a specially tuned version of the car's standard twin turbo V6. The 3 liter now delivers 420 horsepower and 406 pound feet of torque, though it is still made it to the stock 7 speed Jetco automatic. As befits every Nismo model from Nissan, the Skyline gets a revised suspension setup to reduce roll, 
better electronics with additional Sport and Sport Plus driving modes, improved brakes and ABS system for shorter braking distances. The car rides on ultralight 19-inch Anki wheels, which are wrapped in sticky high-performance tires. The owners will be reminded of their Nismo's exclusivity with additional exterior accents, like Nismo-specific front and rear bumpers, aggressive side sills, new LED lighting, and red pinstriping that runs the entire vehicle. The cabin gets similar red and black accents and can be optioned with Recaro seats. Nissan offers four body colors in case you do not like the model-exclusive Stealth Grey Hue. If you are looking for something even more special, 800 cars from this edition will be available in the limited trim, which adds bigger matte gunmetal painted wheels and a serial plate with a production number. Smash the like button to support our efforts of covering new car lineups of the world's most famous automakers and stick around till the end. We keep rolling! Nissan Hyperforce Even though GTR is still in the business, it's safe to assume that Godzilla's extension is inevitable. But fear not, we expect that Nissan will not dare to eliminate their most iconic moniker and instead, the internal combustion engine will give way to an electric setup. The potential successor is explored by the Hyperforce, presented at the latest Tokyo Auto Show as a part of the Nissan's five-vehicle concept lineup. The scoop has ridiculously edgy design, bare metal carbon steel finish, and a huge rear spoiler. The latter provides active aerodynamics, assisted by a plasma actuator that finally adjusts the airflow around the forged carbon wheels. The Hyperforce is a theoretical electric megacar with a solid-state battery pack that juices the next-generation 1 megawatt or 1,341 horsepower Nissan E-Force all-wheel drive powertrain. Concealed behind the vertically opening doors are a forged carbon cockpit, reclined floating racing seats with four-point harnesses, and a subtle suggestion of a rear seating area. The angular design elements of the exterior are mirrored in the concept's narrow steering wheel and the surrounding screens. In the R modes, these screens move closer to the driver, providing essential system data. But switch to the GT mode, and the interior lighting changes from red to blue, with the interface prioritizing infotainment and cabin comfort. By the way, when not in motion, the Hyperforce transforms into a VR gaming haven, offering the most immersive virtual racing experience. Nissan Concept 2023 The new hot hatch concept by Nissan is inspired by the brand's Formula E participation and online racing simulators. Created by Nissan Design Europe, headquartered in London, it celebrates the 20th anniversary of the division and presents the brand's idea of a future Micronismo. The model's sporty nature is established by its extreme exterior styling. There is a large lip spoiler up front, wide wheel arches, a cool-looking air scoop on the roof, and a huge rear wing. The hatchback also gets all-new LED lighting pattern. Size-wise, the three-door is similar to the Nissan Micra, but it is powered by an electric drivetrain. The latter's performance is unconfirmed, though it should match the hot hatch title bestowed on the 2023. Finally, we should talk about the cabin of this concept vehicle. The entry is done through a pair of scissor doors, the interior features bucket seats and a yoke-style steering wheel, while the cockpit adopts a minimalistic layout with the screens displaying only essential info. Do you think that Nissan is a legitimate competitor within the field of sports cars? I would say yes, because the world of four-wheelers will not be the same without the GTR and the Z. Let's talk about the new Nismos in the comments below, and before you go, make sure to subscribe to Automotive Territory Daily News, ring the bell, and follow the links on the screen to watch more lineup reviews of 2024. May the torque be with you!